legendary realms captivate not only thousands of enigmatologists and scientists around the world, but also leave us with numerous unanswered questions. Many mysterious aspects of these undiscovered worlds remain the subject of intensive exploration. However, even today, answers to many fundamental questions regarding the potential existence of mythical continents elude us, as they remain concealed from our sight, leaving us with minimal clues, if any. Atlantis is by no means the only legendary realm or independent continent, as according to myths, there were others tens of thousands of years ago that likely preceded later civilizations and possessed incredible technologies. One of these mysterious places is Lemuria. According to legend, Lemuria was situated in the Indian Ocean, purportedly connecting the island of Madagascar with India and Western Australia. The German naturalist Ernst Haeckel dedicated himself to the search for Lemuria and believed that this continent truly existed. It is said that Lemuria was the continent from which all later ethnic formations originated. On the other hand, the Russo-British esotericist Helena Petrovna Blavatsky had a different perspective, claiming that the inhabitants of Lemuria were descendants of one of the seven original races that lived during the Tertiary period. However, contemporary scientists view the existence of Lemuria skeptically and raise the question of whether this continent could truly have existed. Currently, Archaeologists are increasingly focusing on what is arguably the most famous site associated with Lemuria. We are referring to the mysterious submerged city called Nan Madol, located near the Micronesian island of Pohnpei in the Pacific Ocean. The American mystery researcher David H. Childress argues that the partially submerged complex of stone structures exhibits significant similarities to numerous megalithic findings on Easter Island and at some other locations in the Pacific. According to Childress, all these ruins could plausibly belong to the same empire, possibly the mythical Lemuria, a submerged continent where, as Blavatsky suggested long ago, people with advanced abilities and technologies once lived. Childress goes so far as to believe that the original city of Nan Madol was the capital of this legendary land. Could this signal a shift in the general skeptical view of Lemuria's existence? Is there continent in the Pacific? Described by some researchers as the third of legendary continents, it has over 64 million inhabitants, advanced technologies, and a valuable culture. This continent is called Mu, and its location is placed in the current Pacific Ocean. The possible existence of this continent was first brought to attention by the Anglo-American historian and adventurer Augustus Le Plongeon. He claimed that ancient writings contain numerous references to this place. However, no physical evidence has been preserved because water engulfed the entire continent many thousands of years ago. Descendants of the survivors later founded an empire in the territory of present-day Mexico, preceding the famous Mayan civilization. Plongeon's conclusions were later supported by other researchers, and currently several researches are underway focusing on finding evidence of the existence of the Mu continent. Are there any results available yet? Arguably, the most significant contemporary research pertains to the underwater ruins of Yonaguni in Japan. Japanese scientist Masaki Kimura from the University of Ryukyu has devoted his entire life to studying this site. According to him, it could be a crucial key to unraveling the mystery of lost continents. This assertion is corroborated by a relatively recent analysis from the Faram Research Foundation. According to the foundation, the area encompassing Yonaguni and the South China Sea up to the top of the Alaskan archipelago, Hawaii, and back through Indonesia and Burma, constitutes a peculiar territory where a continent likely existed in the past. The authors of the Gaia.com portal, focused on mysteries, explain that this specific area is often considered the most probable location of the continent of Mu. Is it possible that Masaaki Kimura, who studied Yonaguni 30 years ago, was telling the truth? If you are interested in similar videos, don't forget to follow us, because we will definitely cover the topic of legendary civilizations and lost continents. That's all from us for today. Also, if you like videos full of mysterious mysteries, dark stories, legends or monsters, check out our channel, press the subscribe and notifications button so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos.